Good evening, Gloucester. I'm Peter Vasco. Good morning, Gloucester weatherman. On this Sunday evening, I want to wish all moms again. I hope you all had a great uh, Mother's Day. Uh, it's been a terrific weekend weather-wise around here in uh, Cape Ann. As today, we reached the upper 70s to low 80s. I was actually down the beach today. You can see I'm a little red. Uh, Good Harbor Beach was uh, I was surprised. There were a lot of people down there bathing and uh, there were a few people in the water. Uh, but anyways, we go to the forecast. We're going to see um, unsettled weather pat unsettled weather pattern uh, developing uh, here, especially come um, late Monday uh, night uh, through uh, Thursday, and then Friday and Saturday we could see some heavy rain. So let's get right to the forecast and, um, for your Sunday night. We're going to be mostly clear. Temperatures going to be dropping down to the low 50s. We have a light west wind around 7 to 10 miles per hour. Coming up here Monday, it's going to be sunny in the morning. We could see some increasing clouds late in the afternoon, depending on when that uh, backdoor cold front is going to swing down from Maine as the low pressure develops along it and swings the backdoor cold front right through Cape Ann, which will give us a northeast wind late in the day. But I think early in the day will be in the 70s and some places could be in the low 80s under plenty of sunshine. So again, it looks like a good beach day for your Monday. I give it a sun index uh, 8 to a 9. Uh, water temperature is about 51, 52. There were people in the water today, so I would expect more people in the water tomorrow. Um, so that didn't bother them too much. And your temperatures again will be in the upper 70s to lower 80s for your Monday. Monday night, again, we see the increasing clouds back to a cold front. It may swing through even quicker here in Cape Ann Monday afternoon or, or late morning. It all depends. Sometimes those, those fronts are very, very fickle. So you cannot predict. I mean, most of the time, a backdoor cold front is predicted to come down on the models. It usually comes through Cape Ann a lot sooner and quicker than expected. So that's what I'm betting um, my forecast on right now is that backdoor cold front will probably come through late mornings, Monday, uh, Monday afternoon here on Cape Ann. But it may get stalled up as a warm front slipping to the north. Could see a few showers in western, um, southwestern Massachusetts. Isolated shower or storm um, up here in Cape Ann. But other than that, Monday night, again, we're going to be uh, having a few more showers in the area as back to a cold front comes through. Tuesday and Wednesday, we have a northeast wind. Temperatures will be in the 40s to 50s at the shore, uh, 50s to 60s inland. And then farther out, western mass will be in the 70s as the back to a cold front. cold front will not make it that far to the west. Uh, and then coming up here Thursday again, uh, and looking ahead to Friday and Saturday, uh, looks like we got a heavy rain event possibly here on um, Friday into Saturday. And Sunday looks good at this time. Temperatures will be in the 50s with plenty of sunshine. We'll be keeping an eye on that um, uh, wind and rain threat for uh, later on in the week as we'll have patchy fog and drizzle also along the coastline, especially up here in Cape Ann with a northeast wind. Water temperatures in the 50s, air temperatures in the 40s and 50s. You match that dew point and then you get that fog and drizzle that comes right on shore. So I'll be keeping an eye on that as well. So other than that, tomorrow's looking beautiful, Monday. But the rest of the week, um, up in the air, uh, it, it seems to be more unsettled as the models are coming out now um, with patchy fog drizzle and chances of showers along the coastline, a little bit um, warmer over the interior. Um, and then we get into the Friday, Saturday, where we could see a, about a heavy rain and some gusty winds at the shore. Right now for Mariners, we're not looking at, um, if I go back to my uh, computer model here, uh, we're not looking at any small craft or gale warnings. Um, for your Monday. Uh, however, come Tuesday, we may see a small craft advisory or perhaps gale warning go up uh, depending on how strong the winds are with that backdoor cold front. All right, enjoy your Sunday night and enjoy your Monday morning. For now, I'm Peter Lovasco, your good morning Gloucester weatherman. For good morning Gloucester, have a great night, a great morning, and go bees! Let's hope the Bruins can win tomorrow night, or tonight. Bye.